Many of you I know, the rest of you I'm very much looking forward to getting to know over the next couple of days. My name is Dominic. I am proudly from the University of Nevada, Las Vegas, and I'm running for national president. What is architecture? It's a simple question, and it's one that I've asked of several hundred high school students around Las Vegas. The answer that I've typically gotten has been something to the effect of, it's just the building of a building. Unfortunately, for them and many others, that's what society has defined for us. That's our value. But for those of us in this room, we know architecture to be more than that. It's shelter, but it's also culture, identity, it's history, it's the influence that we have in our society. And this thesis that architecture is more permeates everything that we do here at the AIS. Serving as your quad and director, I've had the amazing opportunity to watch many of you in this room, the designers, the advocates, show this every day. It's what inspired me to run for quad director in the first place. And now, it's what has inspired me to continue my impact and run for national president. Tonight, I'm running because I believe that we must increase your visibility, your voice, to show the whole world what our value is. I'm running because I believe that we must increase your interactions with other organizations to increase your design advocacy impact. And tonight, I'm running because I believe that I do not have all of the answers. Each one of us in this room is one six thousandth of this organization. I want to know what's your vision for the future of this organization. What's your beliefs? Together, we can tell the whole world with all certainty and conviction, what is architecture?
The next year, the AIS is going to be critical, but that time of the growth is going to be exponential. Thank you very much.
All right. Thank you to uh, all of our officer candidates, the people running for president and vice president. And now we're going to move on to the director candidates. So uh, as you may uh, have already figured out, the, uh, the United States and Canada portion of our membership is broken up into four quadrants. So uh, those of you, so all of you will be, will be just voting for the, the quadrant director within your own, within, for the quadrant director that will be representing you on the board of directors. So we're going to begin with the West Quad, our host squad. So um, the, uh, our first candidate for West Quad director is Wyatt Swing. Hi friends, my name is Wyatt Sewell and I'm from the University of Arizona, currently as the AIAS president. I have learned many different things with AIAS, but one main thing to, is that to be involved is to be heard. And another thing as AIAS president is that I learned that I have a platform and I want to make sure that that platform is put to good use and that the students at my school are heard and their voices are made to cause change. And so one thing that I try to put into my school is a health and wellness committee, and that's the same thing that I want to carry throughout the West Watt position. I want to make sure that people have the passion and are uplifted to be able to do what they want to do in life. I've met many of you from coast to coast in these conferences and heard your stories and have been impacted by them. I really want to make sure that your voice is heard and that you have the chance to be able to make change, and I want to make that change happen for you. So join me on this journey of advocacy and vote for me to be your 2019-2020 West Quad Director. Thank you. All right, our second candidate for West Quad Director is Sir Takatsu. I have seen 
seen a need and I have believed that I can fulfill that need. Whether it be as treasurer, chapter president, or even <coughs> West Quad director. It was, I was not called to lead. I choose to lead. Thank you.
And now we'll move on to the uh, candidates for <coughs> now, now we'll move on to the candidates for the Northeast Quad. Uh, so uh, our first candidate for Northeast Quad director is Nerv O'Ain.
Our next candidate from North East Quadrant Center is Chitika, sorry, Chitika Vasudev. Thank you, Kishika. This room is full of leaders. The person to your right is a leader. The person to your left is too. Most importantly, so is the person sitting right here in your seat. Good evening, AIS. My name is Chitika Vasudev, and I stand before you tonight on the shoulders of all those who have stood here before me. As a first year, I was completely unaware of the power of my voice until an AIS leader tapped on my shoulder and said, we could use someone like you. This empowered me throughout my AIS career, during which I have managed finances, liaised with the AIA, and coordinated national advocacy efforts. The range of my experience has equipped me to now act as a resource for a diverse set of leaders with unique goals and approaches, and is elected as your next 2019-2020 Northeast Quadrant Director, I feel prepared to tap on your shoulders and empower each of you to discover the leader with him.
uh, I got to keep playing with the advancement and transparency of education is very important to me. Um, if you don't know, there's lots of freshmen out there right now who have no idea what they're getting into when they sign up for architecture. Um, architects do so much more than create pretty sculptures and put windows on them, which is kind of what some things have become in schools in school of architecture. Uh, we should be teaching all aspects of this industry from the get-go, and that's what I want to, that's kind of the issue that I want to deal with. I presented this to a group of CSI fellows at a national meeting in October, and I was called rebellious. Uh, that idea is rebellious, then we have a problem. Yeah. The AIS has the influence and the passionate membership to make real differences, not only in the lives of university students, but K-12 students and professionals. Uh, and I can't wait to do that with you. Thank you. Our next candidate for South Park Practice is Carl Dilcher. Where they came from, 
and of course the weird late night studio stories. That form was also the year that Sarah Walgren from Auburn ran for and won national president. I was inspired by what members of my chapter accomplished and the work that was being done in chapters across the country. I got so excited that on the plane ride home, I made a list on my phone about what I wanted to accomplish as South Quad director one day. Three years later, I'm finally here. I am beyond thrilled to talk to you about your chapters, hear your stories, and learn what makes you passionate about AIS. My name is Kira Stark, and I will be honored to serve as your next South Quad director. All right, so that is all of our, uh, all of our certified candidates. We do have one undeclared candidate.